What is up, fam? Welcome back to Leslie Jones Tarot. So I did uh, pull a few cards, and this is another energy that I'm picking up on, okay? Um, this is just, I'm going to do this as a collective reading. Okay, this one's going to be a collective because I just said what's coming in for the collective. Okay, so the first two cards that came out is expectation and community. Okay, so somebody is concerned, okay? They were expecting something to go their way in a community situation, a family situation, around people that they are familiar with, with people who they've known, okay? They are, they kind of got distracted. It's like they're kind of looking up on this, this outside window because they're like, oh, everything's going to be okay. Somebody could be trying to stay in the house and avoid the community as well. This could also be somebody thinking that they're about to like, you know, Things are going to turn out for them. They're, things are going to be good for them. They're going to be welcomed into this situation or they're going to be viewed in some sort of way, in a good way, okay? Um, but there's somebody, something didn't turn out the way that they expected it to, okay? It's like they couldn't see it. They had their back turned or they didn't see something for what it was or they, they were oblivious to it or whatever it is. And then I clarified and I got judgment, devil, and five of cups. So somebody is now in regret, because they made some sort of toxic judgment call in a situation. Somebody could have been out of uh, toxic energy, playing in devil energy. Uh, devil energy is greed, materialism, addiction, depression, mental health issues, ego, secrecy, that type of stuff. Okay. And so somebody is realizing that, you know, like waking, waking up and realizing like, oh my gosh, I've been playing in this devil energy with this person or with the situation. And now I have these regrets. Now I feel guilty. Now I feel remorseful. Okay. Now I want to isolate. Somebody could be, again, staying in the house a lot. Somebody's heart could be breaking. Somebody could also be mourning a situation as well. And then I clarified that and we have rejected. So somebody could be rejecting somebody or somebody feels rejected, outcasted, like they don't belong. So sorry for that. Stop, baby. Impersonator wants to be you, acts like, dresses like, looks like, copies you. Somebody could be realizing that somebody is an impersonator. This is somebody who wants to be like somebody that they're not or they pretended to have something that they really don't have. Um, this is also like giving me like catfish, copycat energy. Uh, threatening, intimidated, threatened, bothered. Somebody is realizing that somebody is threatened by them or they're intimidated by another person or this could be you intimidated by you in some sort of way. We have lonely. So somebody could be wanting to isolate themselves with ignoring um, and wanting to be by themselves. This could be also somebody just feeling like they're in a very dark place again because they were operating in this devilish energy. Sorry about that, y'all. There's snow and my son in the background. But somebody uh, was just operating in this devilish energy and it's like they kept ignoring it or they're like, no, I just leave me alone for right now. I can't believe this is what's going on. But it looks like somebody is about to be um, exposed in some sort of way in front of the community, in front of other people. And um, somebody is very regretful, again, because they were in very toxic energy when this happened. What's the expectation with community? Leave that lamp alone, girl. All right, and she over playing. Snow, you better leave that lamp alone. Quit messing with that lampshade. What's the expectation with the community card? She's supposed to be laying down. Marriage. So this could have to do with a marriage, a commitment, or a relationship that somebody is in. Somebody could be needing to forgive somebody. Ma'am, get down, sweetheart. Where's her binky at? Get your bottle and drink your bottle. So somebody could be wanting forgiveness. Yeah, revengeful force and justice and red flags. Somebody is now seeing the red flags for a situation. There could have already been some. Uh, somebody has been out to try to get somebody, you know, get revenge on somebody. This could have been somebody that somebody was married to or in a connection with or in a relationship with in some sort of way. Somebody could smoke. Something about smoking could be of significance as well. Yeah, making amends, resolving a misunderstanding. Um, we also have... I clarified more and I got moving, change of residence, moving in with your partner. So somebody could have been planning to move in with somebody. We have the frivolity card, okay? And I always like to read this just to double check what the frivolity meant because I never remember. Frivolity is lack of seriousness, lightheartedness, joking, and fun. So somebody could be saying like, oh, we're going to move in together. We're going to be together, boo, 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 right? But now somebody's realizing like they, they're not even taking that serious. Somebody could be talking about buying a home or something like that. And somebody's like, I'm not even taking that serious. This is misfortune. This is, this is destruction. I mean, this person is literally jumping out of the tower to escape this tower moment, this, this rubbish, this, whatever this is, this on fire, like this person is trying to escape this. So somebody, there could be something about somebody moving, okay? Or 
uh, ending a lease or moving away or no longer wanting to be living with someone or being with somebody or buying or investing in a property or something like that, moving in with another person. This could also be somebody realizing like, if I move in with you or I go into this house or whatever with you, like this is me signing myself up for like misfortune. Like I don't want to do this. And then we have earth sign energy, right? Earth sign energy is Taurus Virgo Capricorn. Now somebody could either be dealing with an, an earth sign or this is just someone that's in this earthly energy. Okay, this is that, you know, things that you can touch, taste, feel, and see. Money, values, stuff that grounds you, work, you know, that type of energy. We have the gift. So somebody could have gave somebody a gift. This could have been in money. This could have been in time, energy, effort, right? Somebody could have gave somebody a gift. We have soldier and servant. Somebody could have been really, like, willing to fight for somebody, really, you know, give them service, um, be there for somebody, be willing to... So somebody could be gifted with something or somebody already did this, okay? Somebody could have already gifted somebody with something. What's the earth sign? And it was because they wanted to help somebody fight or they want to help somebody out or this is what's going to happen. What's the earth sign energy? Bipolar disorder. Somebody could be finding unwanted opinions. People giving you unsolicited advice or feedback. So other people could have been saying like, don't do that. Don't give that to that person or don't, you know, whatever, whatever. And somebody could have went against the grain and did it anyway. And now somebody's realizing that somebody's very bipolar. They're, you know, they're hot one minute, they're cold one minute, their emotions are all over the place. And now somebody's realizing that. So the other energy that I was clarifying is concern and high honor. Now somebody is worried about, I'm getting like reputation, worried about their clout, worried about how they're perceived. Okay, worried about their, for some of y'all, this is somebody that's in um, like a high status or they have like some sort of... Um, name for themselves or something like that like high honor is somebody that's well respected well admired they're looked up to things like that you know they they take a lot of pride in who they are okay and so now somebody is concerned with that we have 33 and 25 28 20 uh 39 we have the Eight of Cups, the Eight of Wands, and the Wheel of Fortune. This is somebody wishing that they would have walked away from a situation, abandoned a situation, or this is what's about to happen. Because the Eight of Wands, something is speeding up. The Wheel of Fortune is turning. Things are fated to happen this way. This was meant to happen this way. This could also be karma playing out. This is chance, good luck, destiny, dec uh, decisive moments, um, fate, okay, upheaval. Somebody could be going, it, it just depends on if you've been putting out good energy or negative energy. If you've been putting out negative energy, then karma is about to dish out the same energy that you, you know, the wheel is turning, okay? Karma is about to dish out the same energy that you've been putting out, okay? Whatever that is. So, sorry, somebody is now realizing, like, I need to go do some sort of introspection. I need to withdraw. Somebody could be very disappointment, disappointed, um... They could be looking for a truth in a situation. This could also be somebody traveling, okay, wanting some sort of freedom. They could be rushing to do something here. Um, and now things are like gaining momentum, like things are now getting serious. But again, somebody's really concerned because they're like, oh my gosh, like, how am I going to be viewed? There could also be like higher people at work here with the high honor. Like, you know, this could be the law involved. This could be a, a higher boss, okay, somebody that's over you, that type of energy. And then we have broke butt, okay. Y'all see what it say, but I'm going to say, but my kids in here. Um, happiness hater. Okay, so somebody could be going through some sort of financial issues. My nose is itching like crazy. Financial issues and things like that. Oh, excuse me. And um, somebody is a happiness hater. So this person could be really be hating on somebody else's happiness. And this is why this will is turning in somebody's favor. Inside scoop or close to look nosy up in your business. And now somebody's all up in this person's business. Like, well, why is this happening? Why are you, why is this going on with you? Why, boo, 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 right? And it could have something with somebody giving somebody money or needing to give somebody money. Somebody could owe somebody, need to pay somebody back. And the higher ups are coming in as well. We have guardian, okay? A lost loved one watches over you. So somebody could have been protected or they thought they were protected in a situation, surprising child. It could have had something to do with a child. Okay, somebody could have surprised somebody with some sort of payment or was uh, wanting to surprise somebody with some sort of money or something like that. Because if you look at the surprise, there's money in this. Okay, and again, somebody, this could have been somebody thinking that they were going to receive a gift because we have gift here and somebody was going to gift them with something, whether it was a child, a new beginning, growth, uh, fertility in some sort of way. But somebody is coming to realize that some of y'all can be dealing with an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, or this is communication coming in that somebody has basically yeah. bewitched them, put a love spell on them, told them certain things that it wasn't. You know, this is manipulation. Words not ma matching actions in some sort of way. 
lover and foe. Somebody could have been coming off like they're a, a loving person. You know, they, I love you. This is that, blah, 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 blah. But somebody has realized that they are literally dealing with the, the, the foe. Like this is somebody that can't be trusted. That does not need to be trusted. You know, this is like sleeping with the enemy type of energy, lover and foe here. Somebody is now realizing like you've been manipulating me or you've been uh, love bombing me. Love, because it, I'm getting like love bombing me as well with the air sign in the love spell. So somebody could have been like speaking certain things to get somebody to do something and stuff like that. What's the concern with the high honor? Luck, yeah. Your luck is about to change. Somebody thought that their luck was about to change or things were about to happen for them. Could have been due to their status or somebody that they knew or somebody that they were attached to in some sort of way. What's the concern with high honor? Concern with high honor for Scorpio. I'm sorry, for collective. War-minded militant. But see, somebody was wanting to win at all costs. PTSD. Somebody could be suffering from stress and trauma and things like that. And they're realizing that this win at all costs mentality is messing up their luck. Okay. If things were going in a lucky way for them um, at one point, it's not so much now because somebody won. I just seen 11, 11 on the phone because somebody just wouldn't quit. It's like, I got to win at all costs. I got to fight to the finish type of energy. What's the guardian? Grass looks greener, but it's artificial. This could have been somebody thinking like, oh, I can, I'm going to bless this person. Or I'm going to be fruitful for this person. I'm going to give this person. Somebody could have thought even like, I want to have a baby with you or something like that. And they thought that, oh, if I have a baby with you, then things are going to be good, set up. Someone's being set up. But now somebody's realizing like the grass is not greener on the other side. I should not have taken this offer. I should not have offered this, you know, whatever it was, or I shouldn't have went this direction. What's the air sign with love scale energy? Yeah, second is somebody is realizing that they've been seduced or manipulated into something. Again, this isn't like um, this isn't like real, true, genuine, unconditional love. This is somebody using you know what in order to seduce and manipulate a person. Yeah, switching up. They're switching up on you. And now somebody's going to see how quick somebody's going to switch up on them that it wasn't really love. You know, it wasn't love. It was, oh, I'm going to use you and manipulate you and see what I can get out of you. And then once I'm done with you, I'm going to dispose of you. So sketchy, there's something off about them because somebody's realizing that somebody is sketchy. So I think snow is pooping over there. So let's see what other messages are. Hey, hey, go get ready for bed, baby. Get your get your sister out from the corner over there. One second. Okay, I had to get her situated and put my son to bed. So let's go ahead and get the initials, okay? Let's get your initials. Let's get some, some months. And the zodiac sign, see what comes out. For you, let's see. Last messages for the collective. This is supposed to be a collective reading. I'm sorry if I keep saying Scorpio. I'm used to doing Scorpio readings. Last messages. And Scorpio popped out. So some of y'all could definitely be a Scorpio or dealing with a Scorpio. All right. So the initial T could be of significance. Okay. We have T. We have F, Z. Okay, F is in Frank, Z is in Zeus, E is in Yvonne, Q is in Quincy. We have a Pisces, we have a Capricorn here. We have the initial K is in Kilani, A is in Erica, yeah, R is in Roberto, W is in Winston, Y is in Yolanda. Okay, we have a Virgo could be of significance in this energy. That's that earth sign energy there. We also have the month of May. The initial L is in Lucy. G is in Gail. L is in Le Leo, sorry. <laughs> N is in uh, Natasha. The month of April could be of significance. And we have the Scorpio here as well. So Capricorn, Pisces, Scorpio, Leo, Virgo. The month of May, the month of April could be of significance. I see Carl, K-A-R-L here. I see Carl. I see Zay. Oh, I'm going to get a couple of them. I'm trying to show y'all here. I see Gail. G-A-Y-L-E. Yeah. I see Gail. Let's see. I hear Layla. Nyla. Nyla. N-Y-L-A. Okay. Hmm. I see all 
Somebody could say, oh, a lot as well. Of all. Law. I see the law. Some of y'all, the law is involved. L-A-W. Oh, wow. Law could be involved as well. Lawn. Something about a lawn could be of significance. A lawn, a yard. Mm, okay. Let's see what else I could have came up with. That's all I have. I'm going to leave it there. Yeah, I'm going to leave it there. Oh, key. Something about a key could be a significance. K-E-Y, I just seen that. Key could be a significance. Something about a key. Wait, yeah, there you go. So, I don't know. All right, I'm going to leave it there. Uh, this is what I have for you. Hope it brings you clarity and insight. Appreciate y'all so much for watching. Catch y'all in the next video. Bye, y'all.